If you're looking to add an interesting element to a brochure, newsletter, or even just an article, you might want to consider adding a drop cap. Before you can add a drop cap, you need to make sure that you're in print layout view. To do that, click the view tab and then click on print layout if it's not already selected. To add your drop cap, you want to click on the insert tab and then over in the text section of the insert tab you have a drop cap option. Go ahead and click on that and you have two options here. You can add dropped or you can add in margin and as you put your mouse over each of these you're going to get a preview and dropped means that it's simply dropped within the article and in margin means that it moves the drop cap over to the margin. You want to make sure that before you apply your drop cap, you have your cursor before the letter that you want to become drop capped. Click on the option that you want, unclick your drop cap, and there's a great new element to add to your document.